Well, our time in South Dakota was drawing to an end, but we did make a short drive up to Deadwood, famous western town where Wild Bill Hickok was shot. As I planned our trip, I noticed that Steamboat Springs was only about seven hours southwest of the Mount Rushmore area. So of course, I had to go there and visit with my old friend Tom. Tom and I go way back, and in 1996, we did an epic kayak trip in the Everglades. After we got back, I realized I hadn't taken a picture of Tom and I. So here's a couple shots from that trip. Steamboat Springs is a beautiful area, and I can understand why Tom is there. He loves to ski, and he probably skis over 80 days a year. Well, we had a wonderful dinner with Tom, but we only had time to stay one night in Steamboat. Then it was on to Springfield, Missouri. Leaving Steamboat, the plan was to drive through the mountains for as long as we could. We wanted to avoid the freeway and Denver, and we saw some beautiful scenery on the way. We crossed over Hoosier Pass and the Continental Divide, and then we stopped in a quirky little town called Fairfield. And it turned out that the fictitious town of South Park is actually located behind Fairfield. It took two days to get to Missouri, and our destination was Stockton State Park where we spent a couple of nights. We had a nice campsite, and the park was only about 45 minutes from our real destination in Missouri, the Wonders of Wildlife National Museum and Aquarium. Well, I have to say, this place was magical, and I encourage anyone and everyone to go there. My only regret is I wasn't there with my whole family, because I know my boys and my grandsons would just love it. Well, I'm not going to say anything else, I just want you to sit back and enjoy, and I hope you don't think I went too long. <laughs>